Michael Posse, Brian Corbin, Nick Allen, and Rebecca Lee as I yep. get my act together here. Oh, you're, you're doing a fine job so far, sir. Thank you, my good man. Let me tell you that. It's Friday! <laughs> Friday! <laughs> oh, we have so much Friday. going on. Mm-hmm. It is unbelievable. We got the Isley guys. It never fails. It never fails. He always seems to do that. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead and do your thing. Uh, okay. Yeah, we, we have so much going on this morning. $105 mm -hmm. fat cash. Birthdays going uh, on. Yes, Alan Archer. Uh, go ahead and roll. We're extending right now. Uh, again? Again. Yeah, again. Yeah, again. Yeah, go ahead, right, Alan. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alan Archer, if you're wondering, is our meteorologist. Yes, he calls it unusual times <laughs> like now. Caught us, interrupt us. Yeah, he can't, he can't hear us, can he? No. Okay. Good. No, we can slam him. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, you suck. We can slam him. Damn it. Man, dead. Uh, well, since Alan's doing his forecast, on what, what is our forecast for today? Well, I'll be the meteorologist at this point. Please do. Partly cloudy, partly cloudy, partly cloudy. And that means partly cloudy today. Day, tonight and tomorrow. High today, low 80s. Low tonight in the low 60s. And high on Saturday in the mid 80s. Currently, partly cloudy and 65 at Hot 105.7. Thank you. Hot 105. 13 minutes after 6 o'clock, 6.13. Good morning. The station that gives you... Hot 105.7. Good morning. The station you hear everywhere. The morning show. Posse, Brian Corbett, Nick Allen. Oh, on this freaky, free-flowing, fantastic, <laughs> fabulous... <laughs> Friday. Friday. Oh, it's so nice to be uh, Friday here. Partly cloudy skies. High in the low 80s today. It's a little bit chilly. It was chilly on the way in this morning. Mm -hmm. But it's going to be a nice weekend for the uh, former employees you follow at Lesson Center. They're going to be having a picnic tomorrow over at Lake Point. <laughs> Happening at 10 in the morning until the cows come home, I guess. And a <laughs> small donation will be appreciated. So if you get a chance to go out there to Lake Point for the uh, you follow at Lesson Center, the former employees are going to be having that picnic going on tomorrow. I, I got to say hello to my sister. Yeah. To Mara Corbett, because she's the one that, uh, that told that me in. about it. Right. All righty. Uh, thanks, Tamara. I really appreciate that. Ah, yes. Yeah. And she sounds so good on the phone, but then again, what? She just woke up, right? Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> I didn't recognize. I was like, who? Who? <laughs> that my sister? Yeah. <laughs> 17 okay. minutes after 6 here. A lot of stuff going on. Got the Isley guys uh, coming in the house later on this morning. Mm -hmm. Also, your chance to win a whole bunch of stuff here. And uh, late busters and... Uh, Tailgate and traffic at Star 105. All sorts of so good things. So much fun. And your chance to win $105. Fat cash can come up at any time. Anytime. 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 anytime, anytime, anytime. 18 after Hot 105. Go! Hey, Montgomery. When you move your head. 627. Good morning, Hot 105.7. Hot 105.7, good morning, 6.32, music by R. Kelly, Ronald Isley, the morning show posse, and speaking of the Isley brothers. Oh, we got them coming up later on this morning in the 8 o'clock hour, and uh, speaking of the Isleys, well, Ronald Isley was talking about uh, his uh, role in Download the Movie, Uh huh. talking about uh, kids from three years old and up referred to him as Mr. Biggs now, <laughs> yeah, because he did that role in that video. That would do it. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> It's 6.32 now, 28 7. It's Friday. It's Hot 105.7. It's a celebration. It's a celebration. Hot 105.7. It's a celebration. It's a Friday. And if you know someone that is consistently late, all you have to do is call us up. 262-1057. Late Busters, of course. We bust them good yes, for you. Yes, we do. Now, I was wondering, how many, how many cheesy wedding bands have you, have you heard them play that song? Oh, man, over the years. That song came out in, like, 1980. I was 15 yeah. at the time. Uh -huh. I was an in radio. Yeah. And that song had to be the most burned-out song <laughs> of my life. <laughs> now, now, and that's saying a lot, because I wasn't even in radio at yeah, that time. Yeah, many times, us DJs, we get burned out on, on things that uh, you guys probably... We get burned out quicker. Yeah. Because right now, I'm burned out on download. Uh, yeah. I, personally. I mean, because I hear the club and everyone. Yeah, yeah, and never Everywhere but else. you guys love it. That's why we play it. Uh -huh. <laughs> anyway, it's 6.30. And it's on the log. Yeah. 6 now, and we got to play it. 24 <laughs> till 7 o'clock. I want to find sports here real quick. But, uh, let's see. Oh, man. NBA. Mm -hmm. It's going to be going to Game 7 here, man. Game 7. Ooh. Utah beat the crud out of Seattle. 118 to 83 last night. Carl mm. Malone scored 32 points, fell three assists short of a triple-double as they throttled the Seattle Supersonics 118-83 to force a decisive seventh game in the NBA's Western Conference Finals. Boy, this, this could be wild. I mean, if Utah wins, they're going to be playing the Bulls in the championship. That's right. And uh, they could be giving the Bulls a run for their money. That's left. But I still say it's going to be the Bulls in Seattle in the championship. And that's in the middle. 
Right. So there. Uh, let's see. Patino says he's going to be staying on at Kentucky. Rick Patino has turned down a lucrative offer from the New Jersey Nets to stay at Kentucky. He released a statement yesterday through the school that confirmed he had been offered a contract by Nets owner Joseph Taub. I'm a big admirer of the NBA, and I'm looking forward to covering the draft as a television analyst. Patino stated, everything, however, is completely closed. In baseball action, uh, New York over San Francisco, one zip in Philadelphia over L.A., 3-2, to two, that's in the National League. Chicago over Detroit, Cleveland over Milwaukee, and Boston over Seattle. At 637, 23 till 7 o'clock, Hot 105 Sports. You wake up. Hot 105. 18 minutes before 7 o'clock, good morning. 645, 15 minutes before 7 o'clock, 15 before 7, good morning. Hot 105.7, every little thing you do is on our mind. Ten minutes before 7 o'clock, Brian Corbin, Nick Allen on a Friday. Oh, it's going to be a nice day, too. Partly cloudy skies. It's going to be in the low 80s today. Right now it's uh, 66 degrees currently at uh, 11 till 7 o'clock. HBO's going to be rocking this weekend, man. Uh-oh. What's happening? Chris Rock. I'll just get ready to say. Yeah, you're going to be in the house this weekend. Big. Is he going to be doing ATT commercials or something? Uh, I strongly doubt it. <laughs> I doubt he's going to do little Penny Hardaway bits, but uh, his big thing. He wants to make movies like uh, Woody Allen. That's his idol. Oh, he really? He said that uh, Woody is the only genius in America. And uh, Chris has a flick coming out later this year called Beverly Hills Ninja. And uh, hopefully he thinks that uh, if Woody, uh, Woody Allen sees uh, Chris's new movie, uh -huh. that uh, he'll get respect from uh, Mr. Allen. <laughs> I really don't think Beverly Hills Ninja is going to get any props from Woody. I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah, I, I mean, just the title alone. Beverly Hills Ninja. Woody Allen, it had to be uh, kind of perverted. Uh, well, I mean, you know that thing with Mia Farrow and is never mind. It's uh, <laughs> ten till seven now. Hot one hundred five point seven. If you good morning. It's seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Seven, your fantasy is finally here. It's a Friday in the weekend. Thank Just God about a part of it. Thank goodness for that. It is yeah. a four after seven now, seven oh four, partly cloudy, high in the low eighties, and it's sixty-six now. Looking at tailgating traffic this morning, so far things are moving rather smoothly. But of course, you know, Yay! the construction zone tonight, 5 north and southbound. It was tying things up yesterday afternoon with the E-Man, but uh, hopefully it's going to be pretty straight on your way into work this morning. And don't forget, if you see something that we might miss, of course, it's Star 105. It's free calling your cellular one car phone to us. We'll be more than happy to accommodate you and letting you know where the traffic jams are. Stick around. Birthdays are on the way next at Hot 105.7. Hot 105. Hot 105. Birthdays. Seven minutes after seven o'clock, birthdays being brought to you by Calhoun Foods, Dynamite by Magic and Blues on this May 31st on a Friday. Happy birthday greetings go out to Aura Busky, who's 41 years of, of age today. Land and Land Frizzle, they're 35, they're twins. Thomas Sig uh, Sigler is 15 before 7 a.m. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, he wanted to hear it before 7 a.m., but... Oh, okay. No, that's what cool. about 7.07? Okay. okay no. Sorry about that. Okay. Flossie Rudolph celebrating a birthday. Glennis Rush. Erica Rush. Tammy Benson. Happy birthday to you. And Riley. Felicia Hoffman is four. And daughter Jaquetta Pompey is seven. And father Calvin Pompey is 32. LaShondra Jenkins is 14. That's a wish from mom. Felicia and Talisha Ganston are 12-year-old twins today. Brittany Mahone is nine. And her brother Michael Mahone is six today. Thelma Gray is 61. Eugenia Carter is 22 on Sunday. That comes from Aunt Diane. Ronna Carter is 13. That's a wish from his family. She... Kenana Baker. Ken Kenyana Baker is three. Billy Patterson is going to be 44 on Sunday. And Brian Wynn is two years young today. That's a wish from his parents and little sister, DeAntra Wynn. He's going to be two on Saturday. Let's see who's going to get that cake, huh? From Calhoun Foods. Hey, hey. And a beautiful balloon bouquet from Dynamite Magic and Balloons. The winner is... Brian Wynn. Congratulations. Brian's two years young today. As from his parents and little sister, DeAndre Wynn, he's going to be two on Saturday. He gets the cake from Calhoun Foods and that beautiful balloon bouquet from Dynamite Magic and Balloons. Beautiful. Oh, you know it. It's 7.08. It's the Isley guys. Who's that lady on Hot 105? And they're coming up later on this morning. You know it. 7.13. Good morning. The station that gives you more. More than variety.